Have you ever wondered why managing high blood pressure can be such a daunting task? This is a mystery we're going to unravel today. Welcome to the Hypertension Resistant to Treatment podcast, where we discuss intricate strategies for managing high blood pressure that conventional means may not touch. I'm your host, Dr. Tonya Bro Shropshire. High blood pressure, also known as hypertension, is a global health concern leading to severe health complications such as heart disease and stroke. Despite medications and lifestyle changes, some individuals find it challenging to maintain optimal blood pressure levels. Here, the concept of self-efficacy becomes crucial. And self-efficacy is the belief in one's ability to manage their health successfully. It plays a pivotal role in controlling blood pressure. Individuals with high self-efficacy are more likely to adopt and stick to healthy behaviors such as a balanced diet, regular exercise, effective stress management, and adherence to medication regimens. These behaviors are vital in keeping blood pressure levels in check and reducing the risk of complications. Self-efficacy not only enhances problem-solving skills, but also enables individuals to overcome obstacles in blood pressure management. Those with high self-efficacy can tackle issues such as adjusting medication doses, finding alternative stress relief techniques, or navigating dietary challenges and find effective solutions. Furthermore, self-efficacy contributes to managing stress efficiently, a crucial factor in controlling blood pressure. Those with high self-efficacy are better equipped to cope with stressful situations, reducing stress-related blood pressure spikes. Lastly, self-efficacy is associated with better adherence to treatment plans. High self-efficacy individuals are more likely to stick to their treatment regimens, leading to better long-term blood pressure control. But how does one cultivate self-efficacy for blood pressure control and self-monitoring? It begins with education, understanding the factors that influence blood pressure and the strategies for managing it empowers individuals to take control of their health. Setting realistic goals, acquiring necessary skills, seeking social support, practicing positive self-talk, visualization, and regular reflection on progress are all key components in building self-efficacy for blood pressure management. Healthcare provider training is a promising area of interest with research needed to evaluate its impact on patient self-efficacy and health outcomes. Understanding how providers can effectively communicate and support patients in building self-efficacy is crucial for enhancing chronic disease management. That wraps up today's episode of the Hypertension Resistant to Treatment podcast. We delved into the importance of self-efficacy and the need for more research. By expanding our understanding of self-efficacy, we can enhance our ability to manage high blood pressure more effectively. Remember to like and subscribe for more insightful episodes. Thank you for joining us today.